Okay guys, I'm here to tell you how to get tickets to the Book of Mormon. We're here in New York from San Diego. We got to see the huge debacle which is Spider-Man, which I highly, highly recommend that you do not see. It was, I wanted my $147 back. Not good. Go see Catch Me if you can. But here's another, uh, another opportunity to see the Book of Mormon. Somebody told me, two shows in New York you want to see. You want to see one, a Catch Me if you can. That's checked off my list. Two, one you don't want to see. Spider-Man, don't bother. You want to see Book of Mormon? Here are some ways that you have the opportunity to see Book of Mormon. You can see you can come right out here in front of the theater. Two and a half hours before the performance, there is a lottery. That's exciting because there, there are 14 front row seats. Otherwise, there are uh, seats in... Uh, in boxes that you can get. A couple of them are split, a couple are not. Uh, that's one way. You, um, half, uh, two hours before the show, they do that drawing. You can you know, have the opportunity to get those seats. Uh, attend the drawing, don't do it, don't break the rules. Also, there are standing room only tickets. You can stand in line early. $27, they'll do standing room only. The good thing about standing room only is it's at the back of the orchestra section, and while it sucks to stand, you can kind of lean up against it. That's cool, too. Or, um, if you have um, my luck this morning, sold out show. One, two, three tickets, walked up to the window, within 10 minutes, had orchestra seats for the Mormon. Sometimes you just gotta have the good New York juju. Me, I have it. Uh, these tickets are, uh, how much did we pay for these tickets? $137 plus your little fee. But I'll tell you what, it's worth it. We're excited to have tickets. We're going. If you, if you don't get tickets, come and try the lottery or do the standby line. Or, what do you call it? Standing room only. And get, uh, or getting cancellation seats and do like we did.